Hi, this is Anil and welcome to the video tutorial for the learning lad on C++ programming. So in the last tutorial, we have learned about the arithmetic operators available in C++. In this tutorial, we're going to be learning about the shorthand or the increment and decrement operators in C++. So the two shorthand operators available in C++ are the increment operator which is uh, denoted by two plus symbols and the decrement operator which is denoted by two minus symbols. So in the last tutorial we have uh, learned about the arithmetic operators and uh, here to demonstrate the use of this shorthand or the increment and decrement operators uh, consider an example. Let's say we have a variable a and which is of type int and we initialize this variable a equal to 10 and uh, if I wanted to increment this variable a by 1 then what I need to do is I need to write a equal to a plus 1 so the operation a plus 1 is done first you know 10 plus 1 11 and then that 11 is stored in this variable a so if we use this increment operator then we can write plus plus y or y plus plus similarly if you wanted to do a minus one here then uh, if we are using the arithmetic operators then you guys need to write a equal to a minus one but if you use this decrement operator then you guys need to write minus minus y or y minus minus so we can say that the increment and decrement operators provide a convenient notational shorthand for adding or subtracting one from an object the next thing is you know where this increment and decrement operators are used so these are very frequently used in the loops or or with the iterators and we're gonna see that uh, when we learn about the loops and depending on the way we are using the increment and dec decrement operators you know we have two types one is called prefix and another one is called postfix so this prefix is nothing but you know using this increment or decrement operator before the variable name plus plus a in our previous example or minus minus a similarly this first fix is a plus plus or a minus minus so to demonstrate this i'm gonna be writing a program right now so what we're gonna do is we're gonna create a variable let's say int a and i'm gonna initialize that one to a value of 10 then how to use this increment or decrement operator so so here what I'm gonna write is a plus plus and then I'm gonna write c out and then I'm gonna refer the variable a that's it I'm gonna save this one build build and run so you guys can see the value 11 because you know a is incremented by one and similarly if I change this one to plus plus a will get the same result 11 and if we use minus minus or the decrement operator then it's gonna be 9 and similarly you know a minus minus is also gonna yield 9 so I'm gonna save this build and run so you guys can see 9 the next important thing is you know how we use this increment or decrement operator whether we use it as a prefix or a postfix or what happens when we use it as a prefix and what happens when we use it as a postfix so here just to demonstrate this what I'm gonna do is so here what we're gonna do is we're gonna write plus plus a so this is prefix and I'm gonna build and run this so you guys can see here we got 11 and now if I change this one to postfix you know a plus plus what happens is build and run you see this we get the result 10 not 11 why it is so when we use this 
increment operator as a prefix what happens is the value of the variable which is 10 is incremented first you know it becomes 11 or 1 is added to that and that becomes 11 and that value it will be used in the statement so the 11 is used in that set statement when we use plus plus a but when we use a plus plus what happens is the value of a will be used in the statement first that is the value of 10 and then the value of a is incremented so when we go to the next line the a value becomes 11 so to demonstrate that uh, I'm gonna be writing another say out statement here and it's gonna be a and here let's add a new line save it build build and run so now you guys can see here you know the value of a is 10 whatever the value of a is used in the statement that's because you know this is post fix and the value is incremented once we leave this statement so when the next line is encountered the as value is incremented and similarly the decrement operation so if you write minus minus a and uh, if i run this we get the value 9 that's because whatever the value of this variable a is decremented first and then the decremented value will be used in the statement and uh, when we use it as a postfix and run this now you guys can see here whatever the value of this a is used in the statement and then the value is decremented so what happens is the value of 10 is used in this current statement and then when we go to the next line you know the value will be decremented by 1 so don't get confused here if you don't understand please watch it again and uh, thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe and uh, like my facebook page at facebook.com learning lad and if you guys have any doubt put a comment in the video and i'll see you in the next tutorial